So hello everyone. Uh, today I've got a special guest with me, someone who has done MBBS in the same college that uh, I have done, that is GMC Trivandrum, and he has secured a very very good rank, one six one six, for the NEET PG twenty twenty four examination, and not just that, he has come to this rank after a first attempt rank of almost one point one lakh. So. a considerable improvement through sheer hard work and determination i think uh, this is one awesome achievement hearty congratulations dr faisi thank you sir right so what do you feel after all these months of effort and dedication that you have given getting to this position getting to this awesome rank at the national level what do you feel right now sir i feel so happy and so proud uh there was some moments which i feel i couldn't do it i couldn't make it but uh, i some somehow i came to this position and i thank all my uh, teachers and my parents and my friends for this achievement so wonderful wonderful achievement and i sure the viewers will want to know more about uh, your preparation strategies and uh, so that the future aspirants will also find it beneficial so uh, Dr. Faisi, talking about your journey with Doc Tutorials. Uh, so, uh, how did you get exposed to the Doc Tutorials app, and when did you start uh, watching the lectures? Uh, sir, I started to watch the lectures during my final year. Uh, yeah. At that time, the Doc Tutorials conducted some uh, topics uh, like essay topics by medicine by you, Lisa, no, uh, Rahul Jaji, sir. Uh, at that time, I don't know anything about the medicine. Uh, it was much helpful for my preparation during uh, the final year. I I will say that it only cracked the it only it only helped me to crack my final year. Right. Thank you so much. So and then you know you have continued your journey with Doc Tutorials as well. And uh, just tell us, uh, uh, you know, in your journey with Doc Tutorials, uh, it is very important, especially for someone who is starting at a rank over one lakh. you have to build concepts you have to get an understanding so you have to build knowledge first and then you know practice mcqs so let us uh, discuss about the lectures in doc tutorials that actually helped you now let me just start with the final year subjects say surgery so how did you find the surgery lectures in doc tutorials by raja mahindran sir sir it was much helpful for my preparation it was so conceptual and sir described the every topic uh, in very simple way and there was so much diagrams in the books uh, it helped me crack the exam really and medicine also surgery also uh, it was so much helpful during my pre preparation right so then coming to uh, other subjects like uh, pathology so pathology is very vast and uh, again it is a subject that requires a good understanding as well because has a good weightage for INICT and NPG so how were the pathology lectures in doc tutorials app in pathology vandana ma'am uh, teach taught every topic uh, uh, so much clearly it was uh, in first we will thought that it was very vast and it it will be much difficult to cover every topic during my final revision but uh, the understanding the concepts was very much uh, needed for the final revision Uh, otherwise it will be just a line in a water uh, we are drawing line in a water like that the concept are very much important in pathology and also it, there was a whatsapp group of madam madam helped so much during my preparation due, through that whatsapp group and also personal messages madam responded uh, that was more helpful right great great and uh, coming to uh, other subjects uh pediatrics pediatrics lectures in doc tutorials by sandeep sir your take yes yes uh, i watched in fact it was my first lecture i think uh, after you you took rheumatology that class i attended after that i watched sandeep sir it was so much beautiful in fact i loved the pediatrics after watch such lectures it was so shortage and uh, i even remember every 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 words he said during the lecture that's great that's great i think you were a student of the doc tutorials online live batch so yes, uh, yes. see coming to this online live lectures you know can you just tell us these are workbook based classes almost a simulation of the face to face classes 
so how did you find this concept of online live lectures having a color hard copy work with, with you and then listening to the lectures taking down notes so what is uh, you know what is an online live lecture giving you as an added benefit over the pre recorded lectures uh, sir the online live lecture helped me a lot because uh, there was a classroom in my home itself because uh, uh, my parents helped me a lot during my preparation they brought me food to my room itself so uh, in that condition the live lectures helped me a lot because i got my support support of my parents and uh, i got an opportunity to study in my home itself that was very helpful and the workbook was also good because uh, there was about mostly about i think 76 percentage were filled and 40 percentage we have to fill ourselves so it helped it helped it helped me to stay in my track uh, i didn't feel sleepy during my lectures uh, right. that at all so uh, that the ha that happened the concept of lectures it, it will help me it will help the students a lot right right and uh, how did you deal with big subjects like medicine because medicine is one subject that requires conceptual understanding so uh, how did you build your concepts in medicine sir uh, i will say the medicine was a combination of uh, uh, the first year and second subject like physiology micro patho that pharmacology I, I will i will always say that we have to make the basics always strong and uh, i i i understand that in my halfway only okay uh, then i watch the your lectures then it will it was a cake park for me medicine because you you explained everything beautifully i love your lectures always Okay. Right. And uh, coming to other subjects like ENT, Dr. Rajiv Dhawan, sir, again, you know, has a wonderful workbook and he, you know, simplifies all these concepts. How did you find the ENT lectures? Sir, ENT lectures was wonderful. Uh, sir, uh, sir taught initially the Latin's topic. I, I always uh, learned here first. So I will skip Latin's most, Latin's and Farin's most, I will skip that. So, but sir, in the end of the book, the initial topic was Larynx, Larynx, Nose, Ear. So I got the opportunity to la learn Larynx uh, in the best way. And also uh, uh, Rajiv Dhawan sir taught very beautifully. And uh, he will summarize the some topics after the after taught the topic. He will summarize in one minute or two minutes. That was very helpful. And uh, he helped uh, throughout the preparation because uh, in Telegram group also, his group, he put some voices one minute two minute lectures it was so much helpful and what about short subjects you know which are also high yielding like psychiatry because obviously there will be some questions from psychiatry so uh, about the psychiatry lectures dr nadim sir uh, sir nadim sir was wonderful and uh, i will say psychiatry was uh, more pharmaco psychiatry it is much important but uh, the conception psychiatry view will not understand by doing questions mostly the psychiatric concepts are very much difficult to understand because we are not getting any opportunity during our uh, final year and BBS to learn much about psychiatry. So it is very important to understand the concept of psychiatry from a uh, professor rather than doing questions, I think, in that way. But uh, Najimsa lectures helped me a lot to understand the concept. After that, it was much helpful. And uh, then I didn't feel any difficulty in understanding the psychiatric concept and doing questions. And uh, one thing I want to know from you is like, since the exam got postponed, it is very important to maintain the momentum. Now, what doc tutorials we have done is uh, we have put certain short exams, like before the INI CT, the RDX CDs, before the NEET PG, the 2020 exam CDs. So how did these exams actually help you in your preparation? Uh, those exams helped me a lot because uh, it, it it, it helped me to understand where I'm, I am standing with my friends and all. So it kept me momentum during the postponed shift, uh, during the postponement of the exam. I, I didn't much, it didn't much bother me because I, during the last year, I saw the exam was skipped a night before the real exam. So I, I understand that my, my colleagues or my friends will also prepare during the exam. So I should prepare, I should move on and uh, I should prepare. Otherwise I will lose my one year. So right. I I started to attend the doctoral exam 
there i understand that my colleagues are preparing my friends are preparing so i should prepare only i attend almost every lecture or every exams of doc tutorials it helped me a lot and also this was followed by video lecture so i hope video explanations of the shed test so i hope that you have watched the video lecture video explanations as well yes sir i watched almost all um not every not every youtube videos but i watched almost all because i i lacked some concept in that questions also so i watched the fast forwardly every um, most of the videos got it got it so that is great to know and um, see uh, when it is about improving from uh, a rank of 1 lakh to 1616 how was the progress it's like did you see a, a a palpable improvement right from the beginning or was it like after some time you felt okay this is now you know something that i can conquer so can you just take us through that journey where did you feel that okay i'm performing reasonably well i think i can get within 5000 yes sir uh, sir initially uh, when i am when i completed my internship i contacted you Uh, i asked you whether i should prepare in november in set or not then you advised me to take a gt at that time i took a gt uh, i think it was about 46 or 45 right answer and 45 wrong answer the rest i skipped at that time i understand that i i i don't have to prepare for inset it's not my game so i begin to prepare it my begin to prepare my from my scratch the 45 then increase to 65 then it crossed the 100 uh, i was very much happy because uh, it, that first time you know no it was very much happy because my hard work or all is paying off i right. crossed the 100 uh, i was halfway so then i continue to write, G, write gts then i think my uh, last final score was about 150 only right then but i begin, i uh, got that confidence during my preparation because i thought i could do it if i could get uh, 150 from 40 why why not i could get a seat that that helped me a lot sir that's that right. motivation that that kept me inside me so right. so i'm i'm extremely happy uh, because um, you know from knowing you ever since uh, your final year exams to seeing you on screen you know getting this awesome rank and going to your uh, branch that you like is for me as well a very satisfying moment i'll be very honest i'm so happy to see that 1616 adjacent to your name as well i'm so proud of you for what you have achieved and uh, all the best uh, facey for your future as well i'm extremely proud of you for your achievement so thank you driver so also i am i am also happy that i could attend an interview with my favorite sir uh, i didn't i didn't thought that i could attend this i'm so much happy Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thanks. All the best for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks.